What's up, guys? I'm Jada Black. Shout out to everybody that's tuning in. I want to talk about Devin Booker and Kendall Jenner. Kendall Jenner has been playing with this guy, uh, his heart, for years. Uh, every time, you know, she breaks up with him, she goes and dates someone else and then goes back to him. He welcomes her back with open arms. You know, she did this with Ben Simmons. You know, she was known for sleeping with other men while she was with Ben Simmons. And Ben Simmons would, would take her back if they break up. She'd be uh as the you know these people would say making out with other guys, right? Just totally very dismissive and disrespectful uh towards Ben Simmons. And she has done the same thing with Devin Booker. I mean when she went and dated Bad Bunny, Bad Bunny, I believe, dissed Devin Booker in a song. That's how much of a simp he was. And she broke it, it well I believe she probably was the one that broke it off with him, you know, but now because it's Valentine's Day, she goes back to Devin Booker. It, it proves a lot what I say about guys like Devin Booker. You know, I've spoken about their relationship before. I don't know if it's because he's like really attracted to her. If it's a physical thing, maybe she's good in the bedroom or is it because she is a Kardashian Jenner? And because she's a Kardashian Jenner, he likes the the attention that comes with it, even though he's an NBA player. I don't know. These guys are just weird. I would never want to be with somebody that done been with a whole bunch of other NBA players, musicians. They even had a meme. I think one of the Kardashian Jenners wore a shirt with her, with all these guys, these, these athletes that she's been with. Kendall really is for the streets. Kendall is for the streets. She truly is. Out of all the Kardashian Jenners, she's the one who we say for the streets, she for the streets. She's more like, I would say to a certain degree, she's more like him than I would say Kylie is. Kylie likes to be in long-term relationships. She's She's been dating this actor for a while, you know. After, you know, since so she just, she's either very low key or she's with the guy for a distinct amount of time. Unlike Kendall, who is boy crazy, so to speak. And that's what happens with a lot of these, these girls, you know, they go through this phase where they just sleeping with a whole bunch of different men. These are who I call Western women. And there's a lot of them. The sad thing is, and, and Kendall's not the only one, a lot of women of today, especially Gen Zers and millennials. Millennials is the perfect example of this. You got females who have been for the streets since their 20s. Like they, you know how they go through a phase where they're dating, they're not really in anything serious. They carry that over from their 20s to their 30s. So you got millennial Western women who are in their 30s now, making out, <laughs> having relations with a bunch of different men. And they'll go back to that one sucker that always takes them back. And Devin Booker is that sucker. So for Valentine's Day, instead of him moving on, he gets back with a girl who was dating a guy that dissed him in a song. You got, I, I, I am convinced now, more than ever, that y'all like these toxic relationships. You like women who are not only kissing you in the mouth, they're kissing other men in the mouth while they're with you. And I guarantee you after this Valentine's Day hookup, she's going to go back and, and get with somebody else. Kendall Jenner is 28 years old. Devin Booker's 27. And she's going to be like this when she's in her 30s as well. She's going to be out here dealing with a bunch of different men at the same time. And then once she's washed up and a lot of these guys are not checking for her, She's going to want to know what happened to all the good men. She's the one that's going to be going on podcasts trying to blame men for why she's a slore. She wants to blame men for why she is out here sleeping with all these different men at the same time. It's their fault. It's not her fault. It's their fault. It's always men's fault, right? Every time these heifers want to go out here and screw around and sleep with a bunch of different men, it's always the men's fault. I'm telling you right now, in a couple of years, when she's over 30, she's going to be, when she's still single, she's going to be on podcasts blaming men for why she is single and why nobody wants to marry her. Because men can't trust you, Kendall. But 
You got men like Devin Booker, who's a sucker, who's willing to take you back because he likes dating a Kardashian Jenner. You dudes out here look weak. There's tons of women you can deal with. See, Devin Booker is one of those guys that will tell you you're wrong for dating foreign women. You need to date women here in America. What's wrong with these women? Uh, what's wrong with them is is you. You and, and the type of women you're dealing with. And, and the fact that you're giving your energy and attention. You're spending, you're spending Valentine's Day with a woman who dated a guy that dissed you. She was probably filling his head up with nonsense about you. And you're like, okay, well, I'll still take her back. All these, you're a famous, I'll tell you, fame ain't what it used to be. How you are a famous NBA player. You're relatively young. You're 27. You're making a lot of money and you're, you're screwing a retread. Ken, Kendall Jenner is a retread. She's a retread. Instead of you going out and finding somebody new, you're with a retread and you take her back over and over again, even though she makes you look crazy. No matter how many different men that she hooks up with while she's with you, you get back with her anyway. This is the problem with you, with you males and you need to get corrected. And that's what I do. I correct. That's why a lot of you get in your feels when I make these videos. So what? A lot of y'all are out here making us men look bad. You look like simps. You look like losers. Not only are you losing on the court, you're losing off of it. Can't win a championship on the court. And you definitely ain't winning one off of it. The reason why the Kardashian Jenners, the vampires that they are, continue to prosper is because of men like Devin Booker, Ben Simmons. They continue to give women like you know, uh, Kendall Jenner a chance when they need to be ignoring these women. Drive these women crazy by not taking them back. Now, again, you're going to have people that's going to say, well, Jane, he's just hooking up with her. Why give anything to this woman? You should have said, you know what? I don't hate you. I just don't want to be with you. Not even for Valentine's Day. I just don't want you around me unless maybe it's on my terms. But to spend Valentine's Day with her, you know, you, you know, he bought her a bunch of gifts and, you know, without him. She would have been alone for Valentine's Day. That's what makes this story to me crazy is the fact that without him, she would have spent Valentine's Day alone. Devin, you, uh, you, you could have made her Valentine's Day very bad, but you decide that you, that you want to spend Valentine's Day with her, a woman that clearly doesn't respect you, that's just using you because you're a famous NBA player. She doesn't see you. She sees through you, Devin Booker. She sees through you. And because you can't see that, you, you, look like, you look like a chump. You look like a clown. And this is why these women don't respect you males. And, and, the, and the saddest thing is that you males have internalized it, and you're fighting with them against other men. Because we're being honest and saying, listen, you look crazy wifing her up. Look at her. Not only does she have a... a couple of baby daddies this woman cheats kendall jenner is a cheater who likes light-skinned black nba players and and what you, she's also a home wrecker she's the reason why blake griffin had to pay all that child support but y'all y'all don't want to hear that she has no respect for you she only wants to be with you because you keep taking her back See, if, if a woman actually respected your manhood and your masculinity, she wouldn't go back to you. You know why? Because she would feel so ashamed. But Kendall can go back to you, Devin, because you're a simp. And for some reason, you, you're turned on by a woman that goes out of her way to embarrass you. And again, you can say whatever you want, but the proof is out there. It's out there. Just look at her last relationship with Bad Bunny. It tells you everything you know. So that's all I have to say. Let me know what you think in the comment section. Let me know your thoughts. Like this video.